What's up guys? Ian of Winter Dust Stuff here, back with another Ruby reaction. Today we're checking out Volume 9, Episode 9, A Tale Involving the Tree. Or a tree. Um, last episode was really fucking rough for me, you know, as, as I struggle with things like anxiety and depression and, you know, trauma, PTSD, like... That episode kind of fucked me up when I watched it, and I was very emotionally drained by the end of it, so that's why you guys didn't get too much from me um, with that one. But I'm a lot more hyped up now. Uh, I am ready for the two-part finale. Uh, I am recording this uh, the day that episode 10 has dropped. Uh, so I'm, I'm very excited to see uh, where this goes, because... I, I just want our girl, Ruby, to be happy. I want her to be safe. Like, I know that there has to be some sort of change, you know, like, at least mentally. Like, to me, there has to be some sort of change for this all to be, you know, like, written well, I guess. Either that... I don't really know what needs to happen for this because I'm... I'm kind of conflicted. Um on you know what needs to happen so anyway we're gonna get into this thing in five four three two one a tale involving a tree and i'm very happy because there is not a uh, content warning this time let's go I'm so nervous, man. This is like... I need the intro so I can get hyped from last time. Sinking down into depths of nowhere I am undone Grasping tight onto memories I know they'll be overrun Let's go inside. My voice is doing a little bit better today. Um, oh god, here we go, here we go, here we go. What's, what's gonna fucking happen, man? I'm nervous. Episode 9, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. Alright, 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 what's gonna happen? Okay. A door opened for Alex at the tree. Before she went back home. The girl had a great many questions to ponder. After Whoa. all the lessons she'd learned, and the friends she'd made and lost. Ah! No! Oh my god! Fuck yes! Yo! Oh my god! Summer Rose! Fuck yes, dude! I have been waiting ten fucking years! <laughs> oh my god! Let's... I can die happy. We have a brand new sum... And I was right, like, about the shoulder cutout, the emblem in the mi... Oh, she looks so good! Dude! Dude. Dude. <laughs> I am... I am the number one Summer Rose fan. I have been supporting this since day fucking one, man. 
And if there are no other Summer Rose fans in the world, I will be the only one. Because God damn it, she has gone without like a proper, actual, her own model for years. And we fuck yes, dude. Fuck yeah. All right, let roll that back. Okay. My God! A door opened. That's what the for pages the turning tree. were. Oh my God, Summer! Holy shit! She went back home. The girl had a great many questions to ponder. After all oh the lessons God. she'd learned, and the friends she'd made and lost, <laughs> who had she become? Oh my God! Would she still be the same Alex when she went back home? The leaves Yo. of the tree rustled, and on the wind, that Alex that actually looks just like question. volume six. What Ruby? Are you? Pardon? Oh, okay. We, we, we zoom in. We zoom in. Alex, the pleasers now, Ruby. What does this place want? Fair, fair enough. I mean, John's really gone through it the most with this fucking place. And now we're back here. God damn it. I don't Yo, understand. Reflection in his eyes. Jesus Christ, man. It's all so detailed. What did I do wrong? We can figure this out. There's got to be a way to get to the tree. Hello there. You appear upset. Yo. Would you be so kind as to tell me how I can help? Yo, Perhaps you are did they ascend? Like, is that no. the ascended paper uh, pleasers? No, that's it's okay. If I can get you anything else, please don't hesitate to ask. Yo. That's what I'm here for. What? What are you? We are the genial gems. <laughs> and we have arrived okay. here to clean up this beautiful <laughs> land and create something wonderful and pleasing. Wow. All right. Good shit. Um? Pardon? Whoa! God damn, dude! Whoa! Oh my God, that is beautiful. They're back. It's just like they said. They came back from the tree better. No flood or fire will ever hurt them again. Hell yeah. All right. I tried so hard to save them. I stopped them from becoming what they needed to be. I was being selfish because I... I wanted the rush of rescuing someone. And I got that There's here. a song in the background. I, I heard Casey's voice. Too much of yourself. We've been telling ourselves that failing means we're no good. But I can guarantee even the best huntsmen in history, they've all lost. Mm. But they were still incredibly brave. Mm. And good. Good shit, Weiss. Weiss. Aw, oh, man. He's been through... Ah, oh, damn. At the same time, though, can we focus on Ruby right. right now? Maybe I just need to... To accept it. Whoa. It's not a place you go. Whoa. Whoa. Oh. Okay. It's a place you know. Yo. Every single environment is just so beautiful, man. Yo, don't don't tear it apart now. Oh. Yo, Herb? The herbalist? Yo, okay. So he's here too. He's been here a while then. He's been here for over 12 hours in terms of the Ruby? show. Oh shit. Oh man. Fuck. 
What are you doing? What are you doing? What What are you doing? <laughs> like, we have to get her out. Yeah, but I think like, I get it. This is how we got here, or why the tree brought us here. <sighs> Acceptance. Yeah. We've done everything we can. Now it's up to Ruby. Whatever happens next, we have to welcome that. But what if she isn't Ruby anymore when she comes back out? God, that line delivery from Barb. Holy shit. That gave me chills. Whoa! Yo! Yo! New herb is not skipping leg day. God damn. That's not for us to decide. Yeah. Yeah. It's not. Yo, that match cut was great. Whoa, where is she? Like she just kinda she kinda just fell, so. Blacksmith? Blacksmith. Yo! That design! She's not clouded in like shadow anymore. Ooh. I didn't expect you here just yet. I wasn't expecting to be here. Is that- hold on. Are you the tree? Okay, so like, the last time that, um, we saw the blacksmith, they were forging something, and it was right after Herb died, and it was the butterfly wings. Is that, like, Little's skull? Because it seems like every time the blacksmith appears, like, there's always something or someone else that has ascended, uh, or gone to the tree, or in in Little's case, boof, still hate Neo for that. Um, like, is, is that Little? Maybe? I don't know. <laughs> you could say that, but that is a simplistic understanding of the tree and what it does. Okay. What's going to happen to me? Am I gonna die? Oh, God. The only thing the that line delivery is what you want to like happen. the choice of what you that, become. That that am I gonna die? Up, that sounded so pure and innocent and young. Like God. You don't know what you want, do you? Oh. <sighs> Yo, that heartbeat? What's that? Hello? Hello? What is happening? Yo, are we here already? Is that our way home? <laughs> oh shit. Can't get out. Because it's an after and Oh, good! You made it! I guess your little plan to get out of here isn't working. <laughs> You've always been the worst of the bunch. Worst of the bunch! So Excuse me! Through the door. You're talking to best girl! <sighs> no. She has no attachments to your world. Oh, Nothing to return to. Okay. She has failed me, just like Alex did. Like Pardon? Alex? <laughs> The cowardly, wretched girl whose story you've been foolishly following all along. The same girl that I followed, too. Because she promised me she would bring me back to Remnant with her. When in truth, she had no intention of taking me. God. No, after talking to the tree, she had a sudden crisis of conscience. Decided she wanted to fix it. Yo, Robbie Damon the popping the fuck off. Oh, Jean. So Lewis went. I knew and it. At the very last moment, Alex didn't. Oh. What did you do to her? <laughs> I think it's obvious at this point, Blake. Damn. 
what anyone would do with a broken, useless thing. Yeah. Jesus. You, you didn't. You, you monster! What the fuck? She's still here. Oh shit. Oh yes. shit. Oh All shit. My work. It's not lost! Deep down, she wants nothing more than to return to Remnant and play hero. I just need to cut her out. Yeah. And she Jesus. will take me there! No. Whatever happens to Ruby is up to her. Not you or anyone else. Then I'll put you in the ground. Let's fucking go! Beat this cat's ass. What are these lights? The souls that are moving on to whatever they become next. Do they choose what their next life will be like? Such concern for souls you don't know. Or is it for yourself? Hmm. Yo, fight scene, let's go. There's no way we're letting you get Jesus. to Jesus! <laughs> but don't you see? What comes out of that tree might not even be your What the fuck? I wanted to be the hero. Like the stories that my mom read to me. I just wanted to do the right thing, but every step of the way, it's like... It's like there is no right thing. I tried so hard. And... I may have just done more harm than good. I don't understand who I need to be. Because who I am right now, she's not cutting it. What if you could be anyone? Yo! Chills. Actual chills with that line. This whole time! I thought Alex made it back home and lied about everything that happened here. But you were the one who killed. Who lied! You were never a brave knight either. Ah, just one fairy tale nonsense. Yo, this animation, Jesus. Hello. Really. Yo! Sh what the fuck? What is happening? Yo, they're bringing back Pyrrha in the Maya engine just to give us trauma. Who did this belong to? Holy it's shit. It's not about who did, but who could. Mm. Can you feel the woman who might hold it? The weight of who she is. Mm. She could be you. You could put any one of them on and leave Ruby Rose behind. It's all so heavy. It's the only thing I can feel anymore. And it never, ever goes away. The feeling of not being enough. Enough. And how would you measure enough? Before she went back home, Mom, the girl had a great many questions to ponder. What are you? What? Pardon, that's how the episode fucking ends? What? All done. All done. This! This! Everything about this right here! Yes! 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 Fuck yeah, man. <laughs> Let's, uh... 
Let's talk about it. <laughs> I can die happy. Ruby, Volume 9, Episode 9. Holy shit, I can die happy. I could be sent six feet under right now, and I would be totally okay. Oh my god. This episode was great. F right from the riff, I this is probably my favorite episode of the volume. I don't care how short it is. We got Summer fucking Rose, man. Oh my god, and she looks so good. Oh my god. I mean, everything else was just icing on the perfection cake that is Summer Rose. I hope we see more of her, like, in the next episode, because the next episode is, like, 20 minutes, um, I think, without the credits and the intro, which is kind of insane. We haven't had a Ruby episode that long in a while. Um, probably since, like, Lost Fable, I'm thinking. But, uh, yeah. Oh my god. Oh, I loved this. I loved this episode. The The choreography in the fight scene, I don't care how short it was. It was great. It was fantastic. I loved it. Um, but anyway, I'm going to immediately uh, react to the next one. You guys won't see it in this video. You'll see it in the next one. Uh, but this is being recorded in the same day. Uh, if you like what you saw, leave a like, comment below on what you thought of the episode, and, you know, my reaction to it. I'm pretty sure the Summer Rose thing is going to be, like, the number one thing in the comments. But if it's not, give me thoughts. Um, subscribe for, you know, new stuff. We've got a bunch of Ruby content coming. Uh, I'm going to be making a review of Volume 9. And I'm thinking of titling it something along the lines of, like, The Curious Case of Ruby Volume 9. Just to have that, you know, uh, ever after alliteration onto it. Uh, but that being said, I gotta go. I'm going to react to the next episode. So I will see you all in that video in due time. Peace.